What is up everybody? Uh, we're down here at the Conestoga River and you already know what I'm doing here. Uh, I don't want to say I disappointed you in the last two videos, but it feels pretty good today. Uh, this is fly fishing, day number three. What do I want to throw out there, man? What do I want to throw out there? I think I'm just gonna go with a woolly bugger. I guess we could start off with something small. Just a little brown one. Yeah, I think I just found what looks like a pretty juicy spot. This spot looks nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yup, yup, yup. Alright, so that down there looks pretty dope. It also looks pretty hard to get to. I don't know, I feel like I have to try it. Yeah, I don't know. We might come back to it. I got like zero good footage of that thing. Okay, see? Now this spot looks pretty good. Alright guys, the only thing I've done while, or since I fished the last spot, oh uh, hold up, we got another freaking tangle already. Oh, I got it. All right, so the only thing I've done since the last spot is I've actually tied on a little heavier woolly bugger and it's black. So I think it'll really match these little bait fish I'm seeing everywhere a little better. This looks really nice here. Just gotta watch my step. The farther away I can get from these freaking Yeah, I need to try my best to get over there to that slack water.
Oh my god, I got a fish. First fish on the fly. My GoPro's dead. Side pressure, side pressure. <laughs> come on, come on. My GoPro just died. What is it? GoPro was dead. Ugh. Well, gah! my first fish on the fly broke off. I think it was a spotted bass. It, it was small, but it was like beautiful. Whatever, man. I got all my frustration out. My GoPro was dead. I'm gonna get back out there. There's more in there. There's definitely more in there. All right, let's get it, let's get it. Well, everybody, I'm gonna save you like five more minutes of your life and go ahead and tell you that I didn't catch any fish today. I lost. I'm so glad this camera was on because if I would not have got that on the GoPro, <laughs> nobody would have believed me. I lost. I think it was a spotted bass. It was beautiful. Like I saw it come up. I just didn't have my net ready. Um, anyways, guys, I really appreciate you guys putting up with me posting these uh, fly fishing videos when I'm not catching, you know, any fish. It's really just number one for y'all and later for me to document uh, what it was like, pretty much. Because you know, hopefully one day. I'll be catching fish on the fly all the time. I appreciate all the comments of the people who are supportive about it. Um, I understand it might not be the most exciting thing to watch, but later when I'm a big YouTuber and I'm catching fish on the fly like crazy, you guys can go back and watch these videos of me struggling. And you know, like I said, it is mostly for me as well. I enjoy watching it. And uh, anyways guys, Thanks for sticking around. Thank you for everybody who's been commenting and being supportive of this fly fishing journey I'm on. Uh, day number three, third time was not a charm. At least I got bit. Um, I saw a pretty cool snake. I don't, don't think I got any footage of it though. I got a lot of B-roll that y'all probably won't see because this video is so short. Anyways, everybody, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned for next week's episode of The Everyday Angler.